Since I was a kid, my dad had worked for HP and I worked alongside him building computers. And so learning about that really like raised my interest in computer architecture and thus that really translated me into wanting to major in computer engineering. So originally I uh, just liked math and computers. I had taken a programming class uh, my junior year of high school so, and I fell in love with it and the only uh, major that made sense was computer engineering. Computer engineering is a perfect balance of learning, you know, the electrical engineering and the software engineering that goes into making all the computers uh, and advanced other computing devices you see around you. That bridge between like electrical engineering and uh, computer science, I feel like that's what makes computer engineering very unique. Taking just the little pieces of everything you know and putting them together, um, creating solutions for whatever ideas that you have. Not just desktop computers, but also embedded computers like you might find like a Fitbit or like an iPhone. Your result is always going to be something that moves or something that flashes or a physical um, output, which I think was my biggest drive to choosing uh, CE versus CS, for example. University of Michigan uh, computer architecture and like EECS in general is very strong. Um, actually, this summer I'll be working at Apple. And so I'll pretty much when I went through the interview process, they, they came here and all the coursework I had gone through here was pretty much what they asked me in the interview. So it was, I think I was very well prepared. The professors, they always just give you the tools. They teach you about the tools and maybe how to use them. And then they give you a problem that challenges you to use those tools to create your own solution. And I feel like that's definitely a great skill to have in the real world, not just with technology, but just life in general. Whatever's gonna be out there, you have to reach into what you know to kind of make your own path in the world. The computer is like the embodiment organization. And what I've been learning here is all the different ways that we can create a uh, computer that's maybe a little bit faster here or maybe a little bit more power efficient or smaller here. And so I hope that as I move into the industry, I can help work with other engineers to continue that evolution of computing as a whole.